You are watching Nollyview TV. Die. What's up, Bono? This your mother in law said, Die. Are you being serious? Which of you is this my mother in law? Fine. Yeah, I beg. She's Mind sexy, yourself. Sexy, like sexy. Damn. Can you stop it? I'm just saying, man. I mean, Fine. Ah, it's your phone. Yeah, but mind your business. You can't be okay. No, 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 that's how I know what it is. Okay, there's something you want to say. You say it, which one is all this? You say, say, I don't know, say, if anything happened to your father-in-law now, say, now you go inherit that matter. What are you even... Where did you get these things from? Which one be... If anything happened to my father-in-law, but then, let me go. First of all, are you praying for my father-in-law to die? No, now, sure. And so, where, where is all this coming from? Wait, oh, wait, Tony. If they try to tell me, say you don't know this thing where they talk. I don't know which thing. Like, which one is if, you, if, you, if, you, if my father in law die, I will inherit his wife. Well, For real? So, you don't know that according to the culture and tradition of your wife's people, if anything were to happen to your father in law now, you are the one to inherit his wife? Okay, stop saying things that are impossible. Which one is that? They do that in it's Africa. It's not impossible. It's, it's your wife's people's culture and tradition, I'm telling you here. You don't know this thing? I don't, I don't know. If, if, hey. if it exists, my wife would have told me by now. No, I'm telling you the truth. Oh. See me, I don't the reason. Say, my guy don't carry I go market, go marry wife from this. I think say maybe you don't go see waiting day before you. So you don't know. Wait, 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 wait. So you're trying to tell me that if I lose my father in law, I will inherit his wife. That is not what I'm trying to tell you. That is what I am telling you. And that is not even what I am telling you. That is what the culture and tradition of your wife's people is. Hey, wake up. What's going on? I want to ask you something. Okay. Is it true that where you come from, that when a father-in-law dies, the son-in-law inherits the wife? I mean, the son-in-law married to the first daughter inherits the wife. Who told you that? If that doesn't matter, can you just answer the damn question? Is it true? Uh, yes, it's true, but <laughs> babe, that, that that's 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 nothing serious. It's some crazy tradition. And besides, my dad is not gonna die anytime soon. He's alive and doing very well. This is not about your dad dying anytime soon. I mean, why would you keep such a thing away from me? Such an important information. Come on. Babe, why are you getting angry? I just told you it's not a big deal. It's some crazy negative tradition. It really doesn't make any, any sense. Like it has caused more harm than good to a lot of families. So it, it, it's, it's nothing. Look, babes, it's not about whether your father is healthy or whether your father is dead or not. It's about you keeping such, an, uh, such a vital information away from me. Okay, what if I don't accept that nonsense? Oh, fine. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry that I, I didn't tell you. It, it's nothing serious. I told you. It's some crazy tradition. It doesn't even make any sense. Besides, my dad is, is fine. He's strong. He's alive. He's not going to die anytime soon. 
But I'm sorry. Okay? It's fine. Just make sure you tell me next time. Alright? Any tradition like uh, any tradition like this, don't hesitate to tell me. I mean there are certain things my own people might abhor. Ooh, you understand? Sorry, uh -huh. So we don't have clash clash of traditions. Tony, it seems you are busy. Not really. Okay, I'm prepared for one. Oh. Yes, I noticed Malata has been busy lately. So I want to buy Okwa. I know you will like it. Of course, of course. <laughs> that, that's actually my, my favorite. Yeah, okay. Yes, my doctor told me. Yes, that's true. <laughs> exactly. Okay, let me get it for you. All right, I can't wait to taste your ukwa. <laughs> I'll be sending you. Daddy, so how are you feeling? As you can see, I am good. <laughs> nice one. I'm happy to hear that. And uh, mommy, um, what was the result of the test that was run on him? Time for the money. Yes, the doctor said uh, he needs bed rest, but he is stressed. Stressed? Mm -hmm. Daddy, what are you doing with your time in the village that you're stressed? <laughs> you're asking us if you don't know your father again. If he does not go for a village meeting, he will go for marriage ceremony. <laughs> if not marriage ceremony, <laughs> He is looking for food for his goats. Hmm? Dad. <laughs> but I told you to always rest and stop stressing yourself. Hmm? You have your brother's daughter to run all these errands for you now. Well, she does. But I only help her to do some of the things I think I can do. More of her. It is also a means of uh, stretching my bones. You know? But she's being paid to do all of those. Yeah? Anyways, it's fine. I'm thank God you're here now so we can take care of you. That is good. But as soon as I'm fully recovered, I will go back to the village to take care of my goods. Hmm? There you go again. Mm -hmm. This man. Daddy, just rest. For once, just take a break, eh? Let us take good care of you. Okay? Okay, lest I forget. Um, mommy, I'm going to be away for three days or more. I'm going for a seminar. Mm -hmm. So you are going to be in charge of this house. You have to take care of Daddy, take care of my husband. And the house. I didn't know I'm equal to the task. <laughs> no. <laughs> I will be taking care of your husband. <laughs> And my husband here. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. Thank you. Um, um, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I, 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 I came to tell you that your food is ready. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to bust into you. The, the, the door was open. Just leave you. I want to steal mom away from you for a bit. I don't know if she has time so she could help me with some things downstairs I'm not really familiar with. Like some house chores and you know. So it's okay. But hmm? you have to go with him to do whatever he asks you to do. Hmm? 
It's okay. All right. Thank you, son. I will be there. Okay. Mm -hmm. hey! Stop, stop, stop. Sorry, I got you all this surprise. How far? See, you need to stop. This this isn't right. Please, I'm I'm, I'm not comfortable with it. Why? <laughs> Looks like you're forgetting the tradition, huh? Your tradition. If that old man dies, you automatically become mine. And there's nothing wrong with me taking care of my future. Stop, please. My husband is still alive and healthy. You're my daughter's husband, for goodness sake. So stop. Look, I'm doing you a favor. Because I'm sure your husband stabs you sexually. Now look at me here, offering you myself on a platter. Come on now. Hmm? Why would you even marry that man? Look at him. Very frail. Why would you marry a man like that? Look at how beautiful. Oh, see how beautiful you are. I'm beginning to question your taste in men. Like, what is this? This is a crime. This is a crime against What's beauty. What's wrong with you? Why are you judging me? You don't even know my story. Who told you he's my choice of man? Besides, because you're not from a, a poor family, so you won't understand anything. Calm down. Don't judge me. Again. Calm down. Why would you be kind? Well, this man is wicked, though. Like, how will he be starving you now, yeah? Look, I know you want me, and I want you to. No, I'm always here. All you need to do is just call me. You need me. Stop. Hmm? 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 Stop. 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 You okay? What is it? Uga. Uga need more baseball. Hey, Uga. Need more baseball. Just like Lina, she don't come. Ama wants to take this. This is full of time. Hey, Uga. Need more baseball. Good job. Musa. Uga. You just see anything? Hey, Oga, I swear to God, I, I never get eyes. Cook. Hey, Oga. I don't know what normally keeps you so long this time you go into the main building. I want you to understand that Tony is only your son-in-law. What is that supposed to mean? 
Ever since our daughter traveled, you've been frequenting that place. And I am not comfortable with that. Oh, wait. Wait, though. Did anyone tell you to monitor me in this house? Eh? So I can no longer go to my daughter's house. Help my in-law with some house chores or what, 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 what is it? That is not what I'm saying. Then what are you saying? You can help him with all the house chores. But you should know when to draw the line. Yes. What did Musa come here to do? Musa? Yes. Because I don't understand this movement. Musa? Mm. I asked him to go and get a shaving stick for me because my beard needs some touch. Mm. Just that. I hope so. So when when is Alicia coming back? I'm supposed to go pick her at the airport tomorrow. Tomorrow? That's good. What about your father in law? How's he? That one. That old man. That one should be happy that he's recuperating. But that guy, me, Sha, he just chose one fine young lady to punish. But why are you sounding this way about your father in law? Hmm. And who's the young lady he's punishing? Patricia. Of course, Patricia. Tony. Patricia, mm -hmm. that's your mother-in-law you're talking about. Mm -hmm. Ha, ah, Tony, my guy. <laughs> so, my guy, you just come out and tell me that you're falling head over heels in love with your mother-in-law. It's not like that. But your father-in-law is still alive with this thing we need to do so. Guys, it's not like that. And then how is it? Check him now. Come on, she deserves better. Mm. Yes, she does. You're right, she deserves better. She deserves better. To be honest with you, if anything happens to your father in law today, I'm I will chase that woman or let me go they give her the sugar stick. <laughs> Girl, you are mad. Come no play with your play reach that side though. I'm not joking. Look, I'm not joking no, for real. Uh, uh, calm down. Calm down, bro. <laughs> you might as well just tell me that you're already poking her. What are you doing? Every time I want to open the gate for the car to come inside, you know, you keep it up. It's very, very, very hard. I'm not so sad when I'm in the way so that you to be brief. So I don't know. Misha, give this to my father in law. Hmm? Oh. It's detox tea to help detox his system, hmm? to cleanse his system. Hey, oh God. Look, make sure he drinks it too. Like right now. To welcome you back. <laughs> Thank you. So welcome. Thank you. Let me leave you guys. Eh? Uh, 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 mommy, so much. What is it? <laughs> what is going on? Are you guys? Are you, you guys are just making it. What's going on? You're so happy. Uh, uh. Are you guys just making it? Uh, uh. What's going on? Are you guys are just making it. I miss you so much. And I know you miss me too. I miss you. So much. I'm glad my baby is back. So what's the good news with the seminar? Yes. Oh, come on, babes, not today. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, mm -hmm. the good news is that um, we'll be having promotional exams on the seminar. Okay. Yes. And if I pass, Mm -hmm. Then I will be promoted. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, you said if I pass, and for me it's when you pass because I know you will pass. Mm. Come on, you're smart. I hear you. I know you will always excel. Mm. So you know what? Well, just go get ready for your promotion. 
Hey, prophet, don't talk. <laughs> Amen. Mm, and you know what that means, right? Yes, I do. That you will no longer, you know, talk about working so hard to mm. get promoted. I hear you. No wonder you really want me to do this job. You want me to get promoted. I'll have more of you now. <laughs> hey, Oga Sony. Sonu Uh Um, did you not give my in-law the tea again? Hey, Oga Tony, now no, Bashi, I give him. Ama, when I go to give him, uh, he actually went away, the JC is, is very sunny. Like, it's very hot. He wants it to be very, very cool. He said, I should keep it on top of the table. I keep him on top of the table and I go. Mm. So you don't know if he drank it or not? Okay, Ogasoni, I don't know, pa. I, I keep it on top of the table and I go. I will take a walk to my friend's place. Oh, okay. I'll see you soon. Hi. Hi. What is wrong with you? What is it? Huh? Please, please, please. We need to stop. Please. Stop. We can't keep doing this, please. We can't keep doing what I didn't do anything. I just... So just leave me. Look, she's not around, okay? What is I just talked to you. Oh, and, uh, Tony, stop. See, How just... can I stop? Just look at yourself. Hmm? Can, can, can we just stop this? We can't stop this. How is that even possible? It's not right. Are we taking a look at yourself in the mirror? Hmm? Anyways, did you um by any chance see my teacup? Um, yes, yes. Um I'm sorry, I mistakenly broke it. It's okay. No, I can't replace it. What? A teacup? Come on, it's just a teacup now. Hmm? Okay, so you. the um the um detox tea that Dad was supposed to take, did he take it? Uh no, he forgot. And by the time I came back, it was already cold, so he couldn't take it. Hmm. Mm. He shouldn't be forgetting to take his detox tea. You should make sure he takes it, you know? I'm sorry about that. Maybe you should give me another one to make sure he takes it. You should take it this time. No, I'll, I'll make sure he takes it. But um, since he's a little toasty, mm. can I also take from it so that you can give me... No, 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 no. That, that, that one is for, is for men. Yeah? Uh, yes, so the, those, those, the, the, um, those governments before you know how they behave. Hey, is everything okay? Um, I forgot some documents. Oh, okay. okay. What's going on with you guys? You guys are cool? No, I'm still cleaning. You're sure? Yeah. Yes. You're yeah, sure? Welcome. Oh. <laughs> so, the, those politicians, they, there's a way they behave, you know? They just move around town and behave like, Stop! Stop this! Hi! But, as you can see, I am fully recovered. And I think it's time we go back to the village. If possible, tomorrow. It's time we go back to the village. When you say we, who and who are you talking about? You and I, of course. We have to go back to the village. It's not possible. I'm not going anywhere with you. But let me even ask you. Why are you always in a hurry to go back to the village whenever you're in the city? Why? In your mana so so. Well, I am wondering why you are stuck to this place. And I want you to understand that Tony is your son in law. Not your son. Excuse you? Yes. You obviously have uh, overstayed your welcome. Yes. What is that supposed to mean? Well, I don't want to sound somehow, but I think you are getting too close to him. 
and I am not comfortable with it. With the earlier we leave this place, the better for all of us before it turns into something. Let me understand you very well because I'm getting angry right now. Which one is that I'm getting close to him? Eh? What sort of talk is that one? Where is it coming from? I'm getting good. I don't, I don't understand it. Well? I am not going back to the village with you. If you are being insecure, that is your business. But it's for me to go back to the village. It's not possible you are going alone. Well? Tomorrow we'll go back to the village. I have said it, and that is final. That's your child. I am not going back to the village with you. He gave you me Eh? You will have to bundle me to the village. I'm not going anywhere. See? Are you okay? What is it? Talk to me. What happened? I don't want to go back to the village. <laughs> but I'm not asking you to leave. Who's asking you to go back to the village? My husband. He wants me to go back to the village with him. Why? I don't, I don't want to go. Why? What's the matter? Anything? Is there a problem? No. No. I think he's suspecting us. See. We need to stop. Hmm? I don't know what to say, but I think we need to stop. Before, before my husband tells my daughter about it. You know what it means if my daughter finds out. Listen, don't never ask me to stop. Stopping is not even an option. If you're suspecting them, we can actually be seen elsewhere. Yes, I could make arrangements for that. Could ever tell me to stop again? And as for that old man, if he wants to go to the village, let him go. But he's not dragging you along with him. You are not going anywhere. Hmm? You need to be careful. My daughter is all I have. I know. We'll be careful. Come on. Hmm? Hmm? Life is good. I told you to come out from this village for the feast. Now you're enjoying yourself. <laughs> I never knew it was like this. Mm. Seriously. <laughs> drink, Joe. <laughs> hey. Take your drink. Uh -huh. I think from now I'll be coming. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. <laughs> Our daughter is so lucky to have that mother as her husband. Tony is a very wonderful man. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I've never taken this type of drink before. This is fine. It's nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Enjoy it. Oh. Go ahead and yes. take your drink. Take your drink. <laughs> the drink is strong. Mm -hmm. It's a little more for me. It's still strong. It's not what I'm taking. Take it. When you take it, you sleep well. Your body will do you well. You drink is doing me so happy. Think you so happy. I drink small drink. Yeah. Drink small drink. Drink. Mm. This drink is something else. Mm -hmm. You should have just taken more. Huh? Hey! Hey! My stomach. What is it? My stomach. What? My heart. Hey! 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 Dad! Oh, you're 
to him. He ran. I was shouting his Papa. heart, his heart, his heart. His heart. His heart. No, please. <laughs> Papa. What happened? Papa. He, he took this drink and that, 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 that's all. How? We have had a tragedy that is telling us. We cannot question God. All we will do for him. All we could do for him is to give him a proper burial. There's no need leaving his body in the mortuary for a long time. We just have to bury him so that he can rest in peace. With all due respect, sir. Uncle, I'm sorry to say. Yeah, but nobody will bury my father until I am done investigating what killed my father. Nobody is going to take his body to anywhere. Oh. Baby, you never, you never mentioned this to me. Look, I don't understand that you want to investigate. I don't have a problem with that. But don't you think it will consume so much time? I mean, you heard your uncle. He said clearly that your father needs to be buried so that his soul can rest. You should also consider that. I am sorry. But you also, and you also heard your mom. She said before he died that he screamed, my, my heart. So it's also possible that what killed him is just a heart attack. Babe, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't tell you all of this, but it was, it was, it was because I, I, I didn't believe my father was dead. But I feel there is a problem. There is something wrong somewhere. <clears throat> my daughter, your father has come of age and anything can happen at any time. The best we can do for him is to give him a proper burial. Anita, your uncle is right. All we need to do now is to give your father a proper burial. There is no need going on investigating and doing all that. Your father has come of age. Besides, he died as a result of heart attack. Nobody will want to kill an old man like my husband. What for now? We will take his body and deposit it in the village mortuary. Then fix a date for his burial. Well, um, my in-laws, we've, we've heard what you said. Um, we'll make all the necessary arrangements for you to do that, and then we'll get back to you. Good. Really? Good. I don't understand what's going on here. Really? Are you trying to say that you're going to allow them to take my father's body away just like that? That is what we owe him. Don't you want his soul to rest in peace? I don't get. We have to start going mm. so that we we'll get to the village on time. Yes, but one more thing. Okay. When we come to take his corpse, our wife will follow us to the village and mourn her husband there, Papa. not here. It's fine, my husband. When you come to take his body, I shall join you to the village. That's very good. Anyways, um, let me give you something for your transport. Anita, how what? Anita, how are you sure that Musa killed your father? Okay, no. Eh? See, at this point, my head is full already. Tomorrow, your uncle will be coming to take me to the village with your father's body. All is in my head now is to how to lead my husband to rest. Please. Please, my daughter. See, I know you're in pain. I'm in pain. Mommy, this whole thing is going to be on the pause. And there will be no burial if I don't find the killer. We have to find that killer. What is that killer? We have to. Okay. So how's it going? Okay, good. 
Just let me know if anything you okay? All right, thank you. It's Deji. Who is Deji? The guy I hired to track Musa for me. Come on. I thought we agreed we were going to give this thing a rest until after the burial. Babe, my investigation is not going to stop the burial. I need to do this. Please just let me do this. At least to clear my curiosity. Fine. Fine. If you say so. But I will have you know that I'm not spending a dime all in the name of investigation. Do you understand? So don't come and meet me for a dime. Really? Are you serious right now? All the okay, now I get it. This is what this thing is, this whole thing is about. You don't want to spend money, Abby. You don't want to spend your money. Good. I will not involve you. I will use my money. No wahala. Dad. Dad, good morning. Daddy. Dad, I'm talking to you. Why are you just walking away like that? I'm greeting you. Good morning. Dad. It's been three months your husband died. And I've not heard anything from the elder. What's, what's going on? It's not as simple as you. They said I'm going to mourn my husband for over and time. <laughs> Before they will gather again and then tell us the next step to take. One, one year is a very long time. Mama's supposed to wait for one year. It's been already. Come on now, in my village, when a woman loses her husband, after three months, she can decide whether she wants to remain in the family or remarry somewhere else. It's not simple. My tradition is the most difficult and serious one I have ever seen. Yeah, I was thinking that once the man dies, he'll just hand you over to me. It's difficult. How is it difficult? Just give me the thing. Let me go with my thing. It's not like that. Okay. So did you find anything? What are you doing now? You people should... What is going on? I need evidence, please. Okay. Alright, no problem. Just, 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 just do something. Thank you. My son, it is our tradition that when a man dies and has a daughter that is married, the husband of the first daughter will inherit his mother-in-law after performing a ritual rite. Not as second wife though, the woman will still be in the husband's house. But you have to be responsible to take care of her financially physically, morally, and particularly sexually. So that she will not be moving about, pia, pia, pia. control herself. You understand? Very, very important. Abomination. As you can see, she is still very young. And you are a very lucky man. He can visit you anytime and go back to her husband's house. Is it not true? Hundred percent. You are on point. In here. I'm sorry. I, I, I don't quite follow. What, what are you trying to say? My in-law is very, very sad. Patricia here will be restored to you because our daughter is the first daughter of my late beloved brother which means patricia will be yours after the ritual as wife but before the ritual you must make sure that your father in law does not have another child elsewhere before your wife we have to do investigation Okay, this, this one is really so 
Mm. I didn't see this one coming. Maybe so we need them. So this is the tradition here? Yes. yes. Wow. 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 Anyways, um, I'm, 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 I'm a very noble son. So, <laughs> and I, I take the tradition seriously. Yes. So I can, as I not go against the gods. Yes, so I have to, it's not like I have much of a choice. I have to, you know, follow tradition the way it is. Okay. Nice, okay, okay. No okay, problem. Okay, remember the conditions. Yeah, I remember. You were um you were saying something about um conditions. Mm -hmm. I have to take care of that based on what work. Physical, physical, moral, that's financial. Financial is not a problem. The other one. Sexually, they change the name, you know. Yeah, it's not like that. Do you think that even accepted everything that he was accused of without missing words? That is really crazy. And now my own mother is supposed to be my husband's mistress. <laughs> and this has been my fear for the longest time. How do I cope? No, just tell me how do I cope with all of this? Calm down. Just relax. Like, okay, let's look at it from another angle. Even if Tony wanted to object, you can't change tradition. Mm -hmm. No. You don't have to blame him much. You have to be easy on him. And you need to also know that men reasons far. He might have seen that fighting the tradition is like wasting time and energy. Hey. At least he should have objected first. Just look at the way he accepted it. He, he, he accepted the whole thing. He should have just... I don't know. I'm tired. I'm broken. I don't even know what to do. Babe. I'm tired. Babe, it's okay. I understand you perfectly. You just have to be easy on yourself. And don't blame him too much. Please, just stop. Stop. I care about you. And I do not want to lose you. You are important to me. Please, babe. Get hold of yourself. Stop. Lest I forget. I had someone to track that imbecile boy called Musa. Yes. You did? Yes, I did. And trust me, this guy I contracted is very good at what he does. I'm sure he will deliver. Are you joking? No, you did that. <sighs> Thank you so much. Can you stop? Thank you. <laughs> stop. <laughs> Thank you so much. <gasps> like you've done a lot for me. This is just my own little way of showing gratitude for millions of things you've done for me. Hey! Hey! Yeah? <laughs> There's some good news. Oh my god, I can't believe it. There's some good news. <laughs> okay, what happened? Now finally, God has made this whole wahala come to an end. What are you talking about? Why are you so excited? <laughs> Babe, guess what? You know that my father's brother I told you about? Uncle Rufus? Of course, Uncle Rufus, yeah. Hey, hey. He just called me now to tell me that they found my father's first child. My father's first daughter. They found her finally. How, 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 how is that possible? <laughs> No, no, that, that, that's not possible. Babe, you what? don't understand. Babe. Hmm? You know Uncle Rufus now, my father's brother. Uh, okay. Okay. So they've been doing their findings and all that, you know, about my father. You know the tradition I told you about? Uh, yes, the one where I'm about supposed to inherit your mother. Yes. Uh -huh. So apparently he's been doing his findings and then he went to this, my father's so-called best friend. That happens to know all the secrets about my father. And then the man told him everything, you know. 
He stated that my father has a child, a first child somewhere, a first daughter somewhere that we don't even know. But why he kept away from my mom and I is something I do not know. But whatever it is, exactly I'm my surprised. point. Exactly my point. Why will he keep it away from your mother and yourself? All right, look, I'm sure that your father's friend is just lying or he has an ulterior motive. I don't believe everything you hear. Excuse you. I don't understand. What is that supposed to mean? But I just gave you a very exciting news. You should be excited for me. You should be happy about it. Why happy are you about like that? Of course I'm happy. Can't you see I'm excited? <laughs> very excited actually. But I'm, I'm just saying that I wouldn't want them to be accusing a dead man wrongly. That's all I'm saying. So all of a sudden, your daughter has decided to spring up from nowhere. And then her husband would have to and reap where he did not so. It's not fair. My it is his right. It is his right. There's nothing we can do about there is so This is our tradition. There is something that can be done about it. Like what? That is the thing. Look, we can settle this matter here and now. Yes, and anything that happens here will remain here. You understand what I'm saying? We can settle this matter now. Just leave your price. I mean, this woman, I can't let this woman suffer in the hands of someone else. Husband will not be happy. Yes, so just name your price. And the so-called um, daughter that, that, that decided to spring up from nowhere. And her husband, if they want, we can pay them off. I'm, I'm capable. I'm capable. Patricia, please step forward. Mommy, do as the great one has said. You know, we have a long way ahead of us. We have to leave here. Take off your footwear and step on this block. And who is the husband of the eldest daughter? I am. Young man, please step forward. Take this. Take it. Patricia, place your hand against this. you are the one saying this. You know the consequences of what you just said. That means, one, you will remain single throughout the rest days of your life. Two, you will never step your leg here again. Even at death, you will be buried in your father's compound and not here, your husband's compound. Yes. I better remain single that being what my spirit does not accept. 
wait, 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 wait. Mommy, what is the meaning of this? What is the meaning of this one you're saying now? I'm surprised you're trying to object to this. But you did not say a word. When, when, when they were talking about how they were going to hand you over to my, to my husband, you didn't say a word. Mommy, what's the meaning of this? No, no, so you want to take my husband from me? You actually want to share my husband with me? Hi! I am ashamed to call you my mother. I am disappointed in you. I, I don't know, I don't believe this. Really? Anita, please calm Mommy, down. what did I do Relax, to you? It's tradition. It's okay. what, what, what tradition is that? Calm what tradition? Down. No, no. Woman, it's okay. My mom! Annie, don't disrespect me. See, it's okay. Well, woman, um, well, if you are sure of what you say, then let's start with the ritual of making you single. Young man, okay. let me have that. You may return back to your seats. Thank you. Very much. The great one. I think you should give us some time so that she can think of her decision. I don't want her to take this important decision in a haste. Please. Hey! Can I have my bags? Let me have my bags! Come on now, what's the big? Come on, stop this. Yes. Yes. Really? Hey! Exactly the great one. You apologize for that. Once it's ready, you send for it. Wow. Tony, we need to go inside. You have some explanations to give to me regarding everything that has been going on in this house. Whilst my mom was around. Uh-uh. Anita. I think you should calm down. Yes, you need to calm down so you won't say something you will regret later. What are you saying? I'm asking you, what are you saying? Were you not there? Did you not see everything that happened? My mom must, must, be, must be shameless to get involved in this kind of thing. Anita, stop! You can't insult a woman that bested you and not told you till this age. Anita, I understand that you're very upset right now, but it's no reason for you to talk carelessly, okay? Look, your husband is not to blame for anything that happened. He couldn't object to it because he was trying to keep the peace. Right? How could he object to a culture and tradition that has been in existence long before he was born? What could he have done? He was just trying to keep the peace. And my mother. She also couldn't, couldn't say no to everything that happened. Ah, oh, it's obvious our woman just wants to break my marriage. It's obvious. You know what, Anifa? I think it should be your mom. Having some explanation to give to us and not Tony here. We just came back from a very long journey. You need to rest and we all. Yeah. Okay. You need to rest as well. Yeah, we'll see. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go now. Sandra, if you're ready to leave, I can drop you off so Anita doesn't have to stress herself. Anita, please take it easy. Take it easy with your husband and you guys settle things, okay? But just know that this man is not to blame for anything that happened, okay? Please. You guys should just sort this thing out. And make it good, please. Thank you so much for coming. Sandra, thank you. It's fine. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you. It's good. Take care of yourself. Yeah. And you Bye, Thank you. Bye. Right. Sorry. Come on. Come on. Who's this person that you're ignoring? Oh. Ah, 
Be the glory mom. It's your mom that's calling. What is this now? Can you people call? What is going on now? What has she done? What has she done to you? Everything. My mother has done everything to me. From the moment my mom decided to drag my husband with me, she has done everything. I am not going to allow such shameless woman. I will not accept and allow her to be my mother. What She's are, not my mother anymore. What are you saying? It's, it's tradition, all right? She's only adhering strictly to tradition. It's not her fault. Really? Yes. Then why did she not accept my elder sister's husband? Oh, she even had an option. But she decided to stick with my husband. That should tell you everything is intentional. Everything was planned. Because she had options. Yes, now. She did not go for my elder sister's husband if she wanted to go for tradition. But why did she stick with you? Me, why? Listen. Fine. She's human. Oh. Yeah, she's human and she's prone to error, you know. So you should, you should just forgive her. Yes. She's your mother. She's your only family now. Look, she's human, all right? She's calling again. Can you just take a call? She's the only family you have. I just have my phone, please. Thank you. Trisha's the one calling you again. She really wants to talk to you. Yeah, hello? Babe, what's up? You did what? You found Musa? Hmm? What? Where? How? Okay, okay, okay. I'm coming. I'll, I'll come right away. Okay. Hey, why, are you, why are you rushing off to? Um, my friend just called me now and she says they found Musa somewhere. I don't know. I don't know how. Where? Where, 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 did, where did they find him? I don't, I don't know. She says they've been tracking him. They, they, my head is numb now. I really can't think about anything. I don't even know what's going on. Well, I need to just go and meet them. And she wants to go there alone? Of course, I have to go there. I'm, I'm going to meet her now. Go where? What if this is an ambush? What if they hurt you? Look, there's no way I'm letting you go there alone. Babe, no. I'm going with you. Yes. I'm going with you. I'm, I'm sorry. What? You want to go with me? Uh huh. Babe, starting when? I thought it was same you that said you didn't want to have anything to do with this 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 issue. You didn't want to have any business with it. So what's uh, going on now? Well, I didn't want to have anything to do with it. Well, my wife is involved now. And your safety is important to me. So I'm going with you. So you like me like that? Yes, I like I'm going with you. Please. I, I must go with you. I have to go with you. Okay, I'll just get my bag. And please get me the car key when you come. Which they found Musa again? Oh, we want trouble. They will not just allow this thing to end. That one self will be running. He won't run far. He will run to where they will catch him. Do you know Madame has finally found Musa? Seriously, Musa has been found. Mm -hmm. When and where? Sandra paid someone to help track him and the person succeeded. They found him somewhere in Ogun State. Ogun State? Yeah. Wow, that's incredible. So has he been arrested? No. Why? What are they waiting for? Isn't this what she's always wanted? Well, I'm sure she will arrest him. She just um, probably has to finish her arrangements with the police. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Wow. I'm, I'm happy for her. She's finally going to get the closure she needs. Hey, what's the matter? Aren't you happy about this? What? Of course. Of course. <laughs> of course. I am happy. I mean, that's what she's always wanted, so yeah. Yeah. Happy, very happy. Um, 
know why I always assigned it to me. I don't know who I offended, what I did. What is going on? Anita. Anita, just stop. You've cried enough. Trust me, God is going to give you another baby that will wipe your tears. My mom once told me, she said if someone faces problem consistently, that person should get prepared because something good is about to happen. Anita, get ready for your testimony. That is all I have to say. Get ready for your testimony. I was supposed to go to the hospital yesterday. But I couldn't. Because I couldn't go in this condition. It's not possible. We can always do that next week. Yes. All the arrangements have been made. All you need to do, just walk straight to the police station, write a statement, and some policemen will be assigned to you. Relax. We can do it next week. So what would it must have changed this location? It means we have to start all this process again. I'm tired. I can't I can't do this. Wait. I'm tired. Change location to where? No, tell me now. To where? Don't even think about that. I learned he started working there this month. So he will want to take his first salary before leaving there. Don't you get it? He never will come out for dinner and we, we go first take salary before he come out. I don't know what I have done. I don't know what, what, what's happening. My, my whole world is just, it's just turning upside down. Everything is just crashing on me. Anita. My life is just, it's just, it's just terrible. I don't know who I am. I don't know what I have done. I don't know why all these things are happening to me. I'm just Please, dying. I don't sake. know. Stop. Please. God knows why everything played out this way. God cannot give you a problem that is bigger than you. He knew you will be able to overcome it. That's why he allowed it in the first place. Yes. Anita, I want us to face this problem together and overcome it as well. Listen, don't mess this up. Alright? I want a perfect job. A clean job. Do you understand? What? Exactly my point. You know how you know how it is with me. I like the perfect job. All right, that's fine. It's okay. I'll call you when you're done to find out how it went. Don't mess it up. Yeah, hey. Who are you talking to and what job is that? Um, ah, it's cheating. My boy, the one I told you that is learning um, architectural designing. Yes, oh. yes. I, I had to give him a job to do because I have a lot on my, on my table. Like I'm swamped with work. So there's this house that was supposed to design. I had to send it to him to, you know, to design. Oh. Yeah. So what if he spoils the job and you lose your plans? What happens? <laughs> of course I would. Of course I'll look at the job before I deliver it to the client. Mm -hmm. But I'm, I'm, I'm sure he will, he, will, he will do a good job. I just need him to handle that while I clear what's in front of me. Like, I take care of the ones on my desk. You shouldn't be taking such risks. You know that, right? I understand you. Oh! I'm tired. I feel sleepy. Need a massage. Of course, what would you say? Have you ever said no before? No. No, do me too. I have to leave. I'll see you some other time. Hmm? And as for Anita, just forget about her. I'm sure she'll 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 forgive you. It's just a matter of time. It seems you will stop coming to see me all alone. Why? 
I don't want to get into any trouble. I don't want my my husband people to to see you, and it's, it's it's going to be a problem to me. See, it's a taboo for a woman to bring a man to her husband's house. And once you are here alone, it's, it's a problem. Unless if you have to come with any of your family members, come with someone, come with Anita or something. Yes. You're always scared, Sha. Anyway, I've heard what you said. And then concerning what happened the last time, I'm thinking you should accept your, your stepdaughter's husband. What? Mm -hmm. Are you... Are you tired of me already? Come on, how can you say that? Tired of you, how? <laughs> it's not possible now. Look, that is... That is one way to make your daughter happy again, all right? Besides, it will help us silence all the suspicion. I mean, nobody will have to suspect us again. Hmm? And then if you're worried about that guy touching you, you can always look for something to tell him. You know, to make him stay away. I'm sure if you tell him something, he won't disturb. He won't rape you now, will he? Yeah, so you should find one thing to say. So the guy is a small fry. You shouldn't worry about him. Hmm? Okay, I I understand what you're saying. But what about if we are caught? Who no, no, will catch us? We're not going, look, I'll make arrangements for us to meet. Not in my house and not here. All right, we'll, I'll always make arrangements. It's not a problem. Nobody will find out. Don't you trust me again? <laughs> okay, that's fine by me if you say so. It's fine. If you need Just... anything, you know what to do. Hmm? Call me. If you need anything, just call me. I'm fine. I have enough already. But if I need anything, I will call you. You have enough. <laughs> hmm? You have enough, Aisha. <laughs> I'm sure you have enough. Yeah? Just go. <laughs> Take care of yourself. You're so tempting. I'll talk to you. Safe trip. Okay. Oh, Crazy, who, who could have done that? Yeah. Who would have done that kind of a thing? Like Anita, I'm speechless. Seriously, I am pained. It may be someone that Musa must have hurt in the past. That guy not get good record. No, 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 no. He doesn't have a good record at all. Like, maybe someone he wronged finally had his way. And choose to revenge this way. Who? Well, why would a person revenge like this now? Why would he revenge like this? Why would you shoot him on the leg or on the arm or any other part? Why would you shoot him to death? How do I satisfy my curiosity? Uh, oh, my father. How do I even look for my father's killer? Who, who, who did this rubbish now? Oh, wait, oh, Anita. What if it's someone that we know? Yes. Maybe someone that monitors our moves. I don't understand. I don't understand. But it's just you and I that know about this whole thing now. And nobody else. Tony is also aware. Excuse you. What is the meaning of that? Hey, that? calm down. Come back from there. What are you thinking? I'm only trying to remind you that Tony knows about all of this. And maybe he told his friend. And Mosa must have wronged any of them. And the person chose to revenge. Oh. Why would they even kill him? What was the person's reason? Why, why would they kill him, man? What can, where do I start from now? Everything, one problem or the other. This is this one problem? Hey. Hey. Who did you go to? Hi. Oh, I I went to see Chooks. Oh. Yeah, so how did it go? He's dead. 
No, I'm talking about Musa. How did how did that go? Were they able to apprehend him? He died. We went there with some police officers and we were told he died the previous day by some unknown men. They shot him dead. Huh? What is really going on? What is it with all these deaths? Huh? No. I don't get it. Even people are dying. So just just like that, your father's killers are, are, are gone. Like that. They just killed him. I don't know who did that. Try the one problem to another, eh? Try. Oh God. Like you're not going to find me. <sighs> I am tired. Something's just frustrating. I am tired. Look, no, no, this is a sign. All right, maybe this is. Okay. Yes, maybe. Look, your maybe. father will understand. You, you have tried. Okay? Wherever your father is, I'm sure he's so proud of you. Can you just let this thing go? So that your father too can rest. Trying to buy um, um, data and I can't. Network is so bad. Please, thank you. Why on earth would you send a, would you, would you send a text message to my phone? What if my wife had seen it? What I, what, what should I have told her? <sighs> what do you mean, eh? I'm saying something reasonable. You're saying eh? You didn't hear what I said? I spoke English now. <laughs> Look, let's just not repeat itself, all right? Do you know my wife was with the phone when you sent that message yesterday? God, you know you fucked up. Now this should never repeat itself. I would have called you yesterday in Delhi. You sent the message, but my wife was there. That's why I didn't call. Now she stepped out. I decided to call you. Don't ever try this nonsense again. I told you. I told you. I said you should calm down. Hold on. That I already sent the money. Maybe it's network that's delaying or something. Or oh, you want to stop calling? Just kept calling. Just kept calling. If my wife had found that, do you know what would have happened? She would have torn the house down. I know the kind of woman I married now. Look, it had better not happen again. Please. Now get out of my phone. Nonsense. 
Imagine the new compo. What's going to be in trouble? All oh, this time is struggling to do things. Now come on. Anita, you mean <gasps> you snapped this from his phone? Yes, I did. This is what I found. How could Tony be this kind of person? How could he be this heartless? Why would he do a thing like this? Oh my God. Like, I can't believe this. Sandra, I have to tell him. Let him know that I know about this. You want to what? I have to tell him. Are you, are, are you mad? Like, are you thinking straight? Mm. Oh, now, babe. Uh-uh. You want to lose your life in the process. Don't do that, oh. Mr. Tony cannot kill me. He mm. can't kill me. But I just let... He has to know. That's he has to play. know I know about this now. Continue to the play. You are trusting Tony on this. After what you've seen on his phone, really? I think you should arrest him. Oh, yes, call police. Let's involve the policeman. <gasps> Sandra, 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 how am I going to call police for my own husband? Where do I start from? What kind of a person is this one? Oh God. Anita, relax. Leave everything to me. I will call the police and arrest him myself. Yes. Sandra, hmm? how do I call the police for my own husband? I will how? do it. Leave it for me. I will arrest him myself. Why would Tony be this kind of person? God, what have I done? What have I done? Sandra, I'm not going to go back to that house again, though. No. Me, I'm scared. I'm going back to your house with you. You're, you're, you're going to my house. Are you thinking straight? Like, are you normal? Do you want him to start suspecting you? Babe, this is a very critical case. And if you don't handle with care, you will lose your life, fool. Oh. See, when Tony starts suspecting you, starts seeing some funny behaviors from you, he might kill you. Men can do anything to cover their parts. I swear. So just pretend like everything is okay. When you enter your house, just mm. act normal. You can do this. Hey. What kind of problem is this? Anita, <laughs> calm down now. Calm down. If you need to help me, so that I'll be able to help you. <laughs> I'm sorry I startled you. I don't think you'll react like that. It's okay. Um, okay, so how far? What's up with the um the police and the investigation? How is that going? Um <laughs> the police, yeah, the the investigation. They 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 they, they stopped. Yes, they, they <sighs> They said the killer, the killer didn't leave any traces, you know, no evidence to, you know, the event and they had to just stop. Yes. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, they're the police now, they should apply intelligence, they should, there should be a way out. Mm -hmm. They should do their job, they shouldn't just give up like that. Yeah, they should. You know? Mm -hmm. That kind of thing, you know. <sighs> well, I, I, I really don't know, you know. I just feel bad about the whole thing, you know. Well, they should do something about it now. I mean, this is a human being we're talking about here. They can't just give up like that. Absolutely. We must have soldiers rest in peace, you know. This this whole thing is just tiring. Oh, wow. So, um, um, what about the, the boys you 
gave the assignment to him today. Did he do it well? What? Oh, 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 the, oh, that. Yeah. Yes, of course. They did an amazing job. You don't even want to see what they did. Like, it was, it was amazing. Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. So, babes, I'll just um, go up. Oh. I had too much in my head to, to comprehend today, so I'll, I'll be upstairs. Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Absolutely. I'm good. Okay. Yeah. See any policeman, so. Officer, this is Mr. Tony. Oh, yeah, Mr. Tony. I greet you, Mr. Tony. My pleasure. You are under arrest. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, where's the camera? Hmm? Where's the camera? I'm sure this is a prank, right? You're here to prank me. Is your friend aware of this? Let me call her so that she'll see how funny this is. Hello, babes. Is she aware? Is she aware of this? Yes. Okay, you believe what happened. Like, I'm ready to see her to crack us. I'm totally aware of everything. You have some explanations to do at the police station. <laughs> you serious? Mr. Tony, like I say, you are under arrest for murder of one Mr. Mbanefo Ezebunlo and one Mr. Musa Mohammed. For that, I advise you to remain silent. For whatever you say or do will be used against you in the court of law. Wait, wait, what's going on here, Officer? Please wait. Why? Tony, what's going on? What are they saying? What's this they're saying? Officer, please do your job. Oh, hold on, please. Hold on, please. I have a few things to tell them. Okay, let him say whatever I want to say. Babe, I'm sorry. I... I'm so ashamed of myself right now. I can't even look at you. You know, started wearing tricks here. Drew my attention to the fact that your mom is beautiful and... and sexy. <laughs> I developed feelings for her immediately. And the feelings grew, grew stronger. As time went on, the feelings kept growing stronger. I couldn't help it. I don't know what got into me. I killed your father. Actually coming to see you. Okay. Yes, I brought you this tea. Uh, is it that type you brought before? Exactly, the the um, detox tea to yeah. just cleanse all your system. Yes, okay. mm. Thank you very much. Yes. Isn't it good? No, 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 no. <laughs> Papa, you have to drink it now. Mm -hmm. yeah, that is the way it works. You drink it when it's you know when it's hot. Mm. Uh, 
It's hot. Uh, that is the way it works. It, it has a, they say drink when hot. Mm. Yeah, exactly. All your bones, everything will straighten. Mm. 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 It's still hot. Yes, uh, just, just be drinking. Some more, some more. You don't use to push sugar. No, no, no. Ah, if you push sugar to, to kill it. Mm. Mm. So just, you just drink it like that. Okay. As we're drinking. Ah. Mm. Mm. It's it's hot. To make you strong. strong yes, yeah. and youthful. So I can I hope I can be getting more of this. <laughs> of course, it's not it's not a problem. Mm. Uh, Thank you very just, much. Just go inside and rest. It's yeah? okay. Uh, so I'll be very strong now. Very strong. It's okay. Thank you. Alright. Mm. Hey, go, go, go. Good enough. You might need to use the toilet a bit, but it's, uh, it's part of it. Uh, okay. Thank you. I'm sorry, I, I killed you so I could be with your mother. I'm sorry. Please, please forgive me. Tony, how could you do this? What did I do to you to, to, to deserve this? What did I do? I'm sorry. I, I, I can't believe what I'm hearing. This is ridiculous. This, this, this is not true. I know. I know. It, it, it's not true, is it? It is. Oh my goodness. Why? Yes. Well, for Musa, when my wife told me that they had found him, I just said I wanted to go with her to see him. Because I wanted to see him myself. And, you know, find out where he lived. And after we saw him, I arranged another meeting with him. And... <sighs> and Musa, Oga, you know I can protect you. I don't you know what I'm capable of again. Not any Oga. You know I can protect you. Why don't you just open up and tell me the truth? Tell me. Tell me if you have a hand in my in-laws' death. Okay, Oga. I have told you. I don't know anything that kill Oga. I, I never kill Oga. I, I don't know anything for. I really say you don't want you don't want to say the truth. Well, like, why won't you just tell me? Look, you're, let's talk like G's, yeah. Let's talk like G's. Talk like you're my man. Let's talk man to man. Tell me how it is so that I will know how to protect you. I will know the best way to protect you. Oga, nasini. I'm an Aaron Semaka. I have told you everything as I know. I don't know anything that happens to Oga. Musa, you know something. Musa, you know something. Okay, even if you don't even if you don't have a hand in it, do you know somebody or do you know somebody or anybody that you think has a hand in the death? That's all you must know something. Oh Ganarin Semaka. Well I don't know anything. I don't know anything that happened to Oga. Narin Semaka. I'll give you 500,000 there. Oui? Meikachi. I'll give you half a million if you tell me the truth. Uga. Sakawa Moon. 500,000 naira. Exactly. Narupo Makasiri. If I tell you everything. Exactly. Why, Uga? Kay Boba Mutun Nefa. You were a very big one, Oga. Kiyoga. The roof of Maka Asiri. I'm going to sell you everything I know, Oga. Everything. Oga, what exactly you want to know from the beginning? Then give Maka. Hey, Oga. I'm listening. Oga. Kagani Ho. On this very day, I was.
saw him. I promised I was going to reward him with a lot of money if he kept what he knows a secret because I found out he was aware that I killed my father-in-law. Hmm. After making him the promise, I sent some boys to kill him. Goodness. Because I didn't want the police to reach him first. Oh, oh my goodness, Tony. Tony, you're a devil. Babe, I'm sorry. You should, you should be in hell. Here I was accusing an innocent boy and, 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 and blaming him for everything that has been happening and not knowing that you're responsible. Move him! <laughs> for your own good, you have to cooperate with us. Move! What was in Move! Move him! Sorry. You are watching Nollyville TV.